Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be a darker video than usual, right? Because apparently a lot of people are now talking about WW3, Israel versus Iran. Iran is uh, retaliating after Israel fired at them. And of course, then Israel is going to fire back. Then Iran is going to fire back. It's like a never ending situation. And the videos that are coming out of it is crazy. Normally, I ask you guys for likes, but you guys don't have to like uh, or anything like that. Okay, we're just going to get into it. Shout out to the homie Asmongold. And if you're watching this, man, Stay blessed, man. I prayers out for everybody, bruh. Uh, yeah, a lot of us are really, really blessed. So don't take that for granted, guys. Roll this. Here it is. And so you have uh, this is just, I guess, an average day. Uh, I'm going to be honest, man. Like, I watch this, and am I the only person that feels like, uh, the, the, like, it's crazy to watch this and to think that we have people here that are complaining about, like, uh, you know whether a character in a in a TV show is gay or not, right? It, yeah. it, it really like oh, of course like they're pushing that crate heavily, and of course people are sick and tired of it. So we're seeing a lot of that content on YouTube right now, understandably. But then you got, of course, like you cannot compare that with something like this. This is insanely uh, deeper than that. It's uh, of course like people are losing their lives, which is no joke. So that's even more serious than that, but. Like, it really puts it into perspective, because, like, imagine living in this place about fat positivity, right? Like, it's actually, like, this is the thing, is, like, I don't want to see the U.S. get, like, entangled in, like, a conflict in the Middle East. Like, I don't want to see us get entangled in it, but don't, it, you know, don't get it twisted. But you guys are gonna. I'm personally in Canada, so it's, like, Canada, U.S., it's, like, the NATO thing, right? Like, it's, like, yeah, it's... It might get ugly though. Like there needs to. They both of them gotta stop though. Both of them gotta stop, man. I think this is horrible. This is fucking. It's fucking terrible. What's happening over there? Like I, and I, I think that the truth is like for a lot of civilians, like on both sides, like they mm. don't have anything to do with this. Like they oh, don't. Hundred percent. Like hundred percent. Yeah, maybe they might not like those other people, but it's not like they're really, you know, out there trying to kill them. They're just trying to live their fucking life, man. Just the same as everybody else's. So watch this shit, bro. Like take a look at this. Oh Damn. my god, look at that. Damn, homie. As far as I know, this is real. This is like straight out of Helldivers 2. Bruh. Yo, Activision is gonna be like, okay, let's make a new Call of Duty outfit, bro. Man. Yeah. You know what? Like at times like these, bro, just gotta if you're if you're if you're a believer, man, like just gotta pray to God, man. Like holy crap, bro. If you're not a believer, I guess whatever you believe in, I mean, holy crap, man. You're bl you're blessed. You know what I mean? I made. I'm not sure. I think they got a few other ones, right? So yeah. Um. What's the message to Iran? Don't. As President Biden said, just don't. Exactly. Bruh. One word. Pretty straightforward what's the message all right well there it is and then there's another it's this one too again the people of iran should know israel stands with you wait the leaders of iran i speak biggest lie wait, ever what bro. biggest lie uh, ever bro like you suckers were striking and now they're retaliating then you suck is gonna strike and then they're gonna uh, those suckers gonna strike it's like it's like a never-ending situation. The way I see it, it's like one of those things, right? Like, you're in public, let's just say, right? And somebody comes up, walks up to you, slap you, right? If that person is stronger than you, maybe you're not gonna slap back, or you're not gonna do anything. Maybe you're gonna, maybe you're not gonna, okay? But if somebody slapped your mother, even if you're the weakest guy there, you're gonna attack back. You're gonna do everything in your power. And that's kind of like what's happening. So, war, bro, like... Yeah, man, it's uh, either if you're on the in Israel, if you're in Iran, or you're, like you're outside of it, like the civilians, like man, like well, all of us are getting affected by it, you know. Even I, I mean, not me, I, yeah, a little bit, but like you know, I'm talking about the people that are there, like they are getting killed, man, left and right. They're uh, the ones getting. I, 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 I don't. These these politicians, man, like they're gonna run away, bro. You know what I mean? They're just gonna run away. They got like their doomsday bunkers set up. They got their doomsday plane. They're just gonna run away, bro. They're just gonna run away, man. It's like you and I, or I mean, not me, but like the people, you know, uh, there that uh, have to suffer through all that. Don't know. The Iron Dome is failing to stop Iran's missiles. Ooh, ooh, holy man.
And, and of course, now Israel is gonna strike back, right? And then Ooh, they Iran is gonna strike back. Bum, bum, oh. Here ah, it is, whoa. and so you have uh, this now for the entire history of America, right? Uh, I, I mean, the truth is, like, you know, there's only, like, I mean, no other country really has the same military power as us besides, like, China. And, like, we do so much business with China, we're not going to get in a war with China, realistically, right? And so, like, it's not really going to happen. So, like, we're very lucky. We're extremely lucky. Wow. Oh, sorry about that. They're gonna die? Maybe. I mean, I'm sure somebody will. I mean, that's a guarantee. Yeah, holy. Yo, it, it, the aliens gotta drop in right now, man. The aliens gotta save us, bro. Think about how loud that is in, a, in real life. Yeah, for real. I think it's crazy uh, to watch this and, like, think about how, how comfortable anybody could expect this shit to happen. I mean, like, fuck. Like, you can't go and kill people over there and, like, bomb them and think it's not gonna happen. Of course they're gonna retaliate. Look at this. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, exactly the point that I was trying to make, right? Like, the, the, basically, war is never, like, the answer, right? Like, it, it's never gonna end well, bro. It's never gonna... Because if you drop a bomb on somebody's, that's, like, somebody's family gone, right? So, that's gonna be a ripple effect. That's gonna create, like, people... Um, that would be angry towards you or that would be revenge filled and understandably bro understandably you know because like if you slap somebody that's like one thing but if you slap their mom in this case like you killed their entire family then of course like they're gonna be filled in with the uh, revenge and vengeance and all that and then they're gonna strike back then you're gonna strike back it's like a never-ending uh situation oh it's like the fourth of fucking july this is crazy Oh. Oh Somebody my. said I'm trying to go to sleep in the comments, bro. Oh my God. Check Trump's Twitter, bro. Yeah, I'll look at it in a minute. I, I, I like this is all just. Isn't it so crazy? Like this shit's happening like in real time. I always uh, like I, I think about that a lot. It's like the fact that we're watching this stuff happen. Yeah. Like live. You imagine in, if we had like the internet the way we do back in World War II, right? You, you know what I mean? It's like these are videos from like 20 minutes ago, right? Stuff like that. That's incredible, man. Like, uh, you know, we're living history. It's surreal. It really is. Let's watch the next one. Yeah. Let's watch the next one, he said. Oh, man, bro, like some of these whoa, are, yeah. whoa, whoa, whoa. Damn, look at them all. Whoa. How many they fired? How many they fired? I, I heard like 400. Damn. I wonder who they're bombing. I wonder if they're just like bombing like random civilians. They're probably bombing bombing like military bases, I would assume. Mm, yeah. I Look don't at know, that. Honestly, but. That's incredible. A mix? Yeah, I mean like definitely there's always going to be a mix. I oh. just wonder like what the targeting is. You know, it's like. Yeah, it's like, do they have a dart board and they just like throw it, throw a dart, and they're like, all right, let's bomb there. Bro. I feel like probably not, right? Bro. Just so you understand what one of the ballistic missiles from Iran looks fired like. What the fuck? Oh my god. Yeah, I would stay the fuck away from that. Iran officially declares a state of war against Israel. Yeah, they wow, had this happened six minutes ago? That's crazy. Six minutes ago? Damn. Wow. And now Israel is gonna strike back, and then they're gonna keep on striking, bro. It's a never-ending situation, and then of course, like U.S. is gonna get U.S. is always they always get dragged in, right? And if you're watching in the U.S., I wanna know like your take on this uh, thing as well. And, and of course, like I'm in Canada, so I think if the U.S. gets involved, Canada's gonna get involved too, Bruh, Like this, and then imagine like you know, worst case scenario, like all of us are getting drafted into it, bro. Oh shit! You know what I mean, right? So it's at times like these, like people that are uh, unfit, no disrespect, but people that are unfit to be drafted, they're going to be like chilling. That's huge. Yeah, it is. That, so, so they, like, that's nuts. Like six minutes ago. Wow. Didn't they do that already? I don't know. Pog, you're on downfall. I, honestly, like I... This is like my honest opinion about like this whole conflict. Okay. I don't really think it, like, at, at a certain point, 
I just think it's sad. Mm. I think it's really sad. Because there's so many people that get killed in these conflicts that have nothing to fucking do with either side. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, They're yeah. not trying to do anything. They're not trying to, like, you know, destroy some other... Some of them will have, like, wild opinions, but, like, those are just opinions, right? Like, some of them would be like, yeah, like, I wanna, I wanna kill you, this and that, but are they really gonna? Probably not. They're just trying to live their life, and it's like, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like the politicians, and when it's like... When it gets bad, they got, like, doomsday bunkers, they got, like, doomsday planes, so they're ready to run away, um, the politicians and all these presidents, these, these things are just gonna run away, bro, you know what I mean? Country, they just wanna live their life and, you know, just be safe, and this happens, it's fucking terrifying, right? It, it's so it scary. Is, it is, Like, and, and it's like a butterfly effect, so, of course, like, WW3 situation, I, I remember, like, all the way back, uh, I believe 2020. Uh, so uh, anytime like something like this happens, WW3 starts trending, and I get it because it starts small like that, and then it becomes like a global thing. So now it's getting worse and worse. Every time so, uh, they retaliate, like it, it gets worse. It gets worse and worse, and it gets bigger and bigger and bigger. And at what point does it stop? Right? You know what I mean? So now it's getting worse. I feel like that this is probably the biggest attack. And the next attack is probably gonna be even bigger, and then the other one, the, the, after that, it's gonna be bigger, even. So it's like a never ending cycle. Who's right, who's wrong? In my opinion, it's not my business. Fair. Maybe fair, that's just fair. me, right? But like, I fair, see this, fair, it's not fair. my business to figure out like what, like who it is or anything like that. It's scary. Everyone's wrong, I guess so. More immigrants to Turkey? Maybe, I don't know. Bruh. It's always has been? Yeah, I guess so. People just trying to live? Yeah, it's genuinely frightening. Uh, wow. Has been trying to be sympathetic? Well, I, I think, like, really, I mean, I, I can I can see if I was them, right? It's like, it's just disappointing that it happens, right? It's just sad. It's, it's like being born in a wrong country at the wrong time like being on the wrong server in gaming terms right like yeah on the wrong server bro it's like you didn't ask for it you're just there you know what i mean like that i feel like anybody like you don't need to be like a fucking you know an empath to understand that it's sad that there's like a bunch of civilians that are getting bombed over some bullshit mm. yeah i mean like it really isn't like you don't need to be a genius to figure that out right i mean damn uh, listen to the Benjamin Netanyahu message. Message. He agrees with you. Does he agree with me? I mean, then I, I don't know. I mean, it's hard to say. From Iran. <laughs> From Iran with love. Oh my God. Holy man. Jesus. That is insane, bro. Crazy. Oh God. Damn. How That's long incredible. It takes how long it takes to go from, like, one country to another, like... Put yourself in their shoes, it's fucking scary? Exactly, man, yeah. Yeah, exactly, right? Like, if you're there, I mean, you do not know, times are very uncertain. And it can get, it can really get ugly here for us uh, in the West too, guys, so... This is why I'm like, damn, bro, like, prayers out for everybody, though. Better everybody build your bunkers? I mean, I don't think it would really matter. Yeah, I mean, the, the type of missiles and shit, pray for Israel, like, why? Like, I mean, I just... I mean, mm. I, I... Yeah. I feel like this conflict is so... Like, in my opinion, right? This is my opinion. I feel like this conflict is so... messy and so convoluted. I would not even begin to say who's right and who's wrong. I'm going to be honest, like, it, it, it's, I, I have no idea. I legitimately have no fucking idea. Uh, it's just fucking crazy. Yeah, the world's against it. Yeah, I guess so. It's completely unnecessary conflict. Most conflicts are like that. But yeah. It always is. It, it always is pointless, right? Like, what did we achieve after World War II? It's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of millions of people lost their lives in that yeah right and after that okay they learned okay let's not do this and we're doing it again we're doing it again you know we're doing it again right now uh pray for my wallet during inflation couldn't give two fucks about him yeah i get that i think that's the way a lot of americans feel 
and uh, a lot of people in America probably don't want to have a lot to do with it. Look at this, multiple, oh wow. Yeah, everybody's gonna get affected. Uh, everybody's getting affected in some way. Oh god. Okay guys, we gotta get off the roof. These are coming down right next to us here. Damn. They're coming down. One just about... We gotta go inside. That's There's nuts. one there. Yeah, it oh, is. Oh. Okay guys, we gotta get off the roof. Yeah, so they actually right are hitting. Down. Damn. Yeah, right. Wow. There. And one there. It's fine, don't worry about it. <laughs> I don't know, man. It doesn't look fine to me. Yeah, it seems pretty bad. State Department's making a, a statement soon. Hopefully the U.S. stays out of it. I don't even know what to say. Uh, no, I think they are already... They have been involved for a while. Now they're just gonna get involved even more and more. Yeah, is like this the beginning of World War Three? I mean, I don't know. I think that... Careful scrolling, there's gore. Oh, really? Yeah, I, I'm not even sure. But, uh... Man. Holy fuck, man. Dang. World War Three, yeah, I guess so. Let me look at some of these other ones here and just see this. Oh man, isn't it incredible? Whoa. Like, because like you think about like the amount of footage that we have from like World War Two and World War One, and like now you have like so many people that are just like recording videos, and you've got so much footage of like this stuff happening mm. from like a live civilian POV. Yeah, ima yeah, that's what I was saying, right? Like, imagine you had the internet all the way back during World War One, World War Two. Man, seconds would have been live streaming. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, soldiers were on duty, like, they would have been live streaming. Had it been they were allowed, or even if they were not allowed, they were like, okay, fuck it, bro. Like, I'm just gonna put a camera there. I'm just gonna, like, live stream it. That's incredible, right? That's amazing. It's just a bunch of fucking missiles getting shot over there. Hundreds of ballistic missiles fired at Israel by Iran. I'm not worried about Israel at all. They'll survive. Um, that I, I think that Israel will survive if we allow them to survive. I think Damn. that the U.S. is really what's going to back them up or not. I mean, U.S. always get their shlongs involved, dog. Like, yeah, yeah, man. Because they, they're the biggest, man. They're the biggest. They're the biggest. You know, they got the biggest military. Uh, I mean, facts are facts, right? I'm not sure. Either China, Russia. I mean, China, Russia, and uh, U.S. Like three big, but I guess the U.S. is on top or close second. Uh, if uh, if I'm wrong. Oh Jesus. Or close first, not close second. Damn, there's a lot of these. It's like, how many of these videos are there? Oh my god. Yeah, people are also re This is the end of Iran? Oh my god. Yeah, people all just go on the extremes. We should drop a nuke on them? Why should we nuke them? Like, just fucking stay out of it. Yeah, what do you mean? Dog, like... They they think dropping a nuke is like dropping dropping like Amazon overnight delivery. Like you order something on Amazon and the next day you get it. It's not like that, bro. Like dropping a nuke, it's finetto, it's over, it's over, it's gonzo, it's donezo. You're in heaven or hell after that, okay? It, it's over, bro. After that, you drop a nuke, bro, it's over. And if one country drops it, the other one's gonna drop it, man. You know, they see like a notification pop up, like nuke incoming, nuke incoming, there's some time. So they're gonna like, the politician first of all, they're gonna jump in their doomsday plane and they're gonna just piece the F out while giving the order, hey, <laughs> commander, drop the nuke too. So at the end, it's the civilians that are gonna be affected because both parties, both of these politicians, presidents, whatever you, these suckers are referred to, I don't even, you know, research too much about th this crap, but it's like both of them are just gonna take off in their doomsday plane and just gonna make a call to the, the the commanders on the ground floor. Can you please drop a nuke? Thank you. Over and out. And they'll be like, Roger that. And they're gonna be piecing out, piecing out in a way where they're gonna be annihilated by that that uh that nuke. It's just like the politicians. They're gonna be the, the they're gonna be the ones that are gonna just run free, get scot free from all this bullshit, bro. There's already a bombing a couple months ago. Nothing will happen after this. No, the bombing a couple of months. It gets just big. The, the thing is that it gets bigger and bigger. You know, it's like not stopping, so it gets. It, it's getting bigger and bigger. Ago was nothing compared to this. Like this is nothing, bro. Like, this they, uh, sorry, that was nothing, bro, compared to yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this is insane. Like this is, bro. This is like the. 
This is like at the end of a mission in Helldivers. Bruh. This is crazy. Yo, what are you talking about? Like the other one, they bombed one thing and it was like a remote military base. It was nothing crazy. Like this is nuts. Yeah. And I see now Israel uh, attack getting bigger and then Iran attack is going to be even bigger than that. So it's like, yeah, it's uh, it's kind of, uh, it's looking bad, guys. It is looking bad. But prayers, prayers out for everybody, man. Guys, check out this video on the screen, man. A little bit lighthearted. This is the last video that we've done. Some video games related, bruh. Check out this video. On the left, that video is related to Diddy. Yeah, check out that Diddy video. Crazy situation too on that, man.